Yo, what is up guys? Pump Crush Fitness here and today we are reviewing uh, ESP Extreme. This is their high stimulant pre-workout. Uh, I got Carter here. Just hit a leg day, got a massive uh, workout in. Uh, yeah, let's get right into the label. This is a, uh, they gave us, this is a kind of a weird one. We have one, two, or three scoops with this one. Uh, one scoop, if you're doing one scoop of this, you have 50 servings, two scoops, 25, and three scoops is 16.6 servings, whatever that means. Um, yeah, let's get right into the label. Uh, well, they give us some vitamins to start with B12, B6, B3. Not going to go over the dosage. Uh, those are all like efficaciously dosed. Then we have magnesium, potassium, calcium, sodium, just a tiny little bit of each. Uh, a couple electrolytes in there. Then we get into our en extreme energy matrix. I'm going to go over the two scoop dosage on this because we took two scoops, two scoops, and I believe most people buying this are probably going to take two scoops because you will see the label. It's pretty extreme. Uh, they give us 400 milligrams caffeine and hydrous. That's a solid, complete, efficacious dose. Uh, that's your decently fast-hitting caffeine. Not as fast as caffeine citrate, but that's your heavy hitter for main stim in there. Then they give us 200 milligrams theobromine. Theobromine's a uh, cousin to caffeine. It's about a tenth as strong as caffeine. Uh, Feel-good ingredient. Nice stimulant to have with caffeine. Nice just uh, overall daily in here. Then they give us dicaffeine malate at 112 milligrams. Dicaffeine malate is normally 75% yield. So 400 milligrams plus 112 milligrams dicaffeine malate, you're right around 500 milligrams for two scoops of this Piroca. That's a lot of caffeine. Like that is the absolute lot of caffeine. Uh, BNers would not recommend touching that much. Like, then they give us uh, our extreme mental matrix, their focus uh, matrix. We have 1.334 grams of choline bitartrate, interesting dosage amount. Uh, choline bitartrate, uh, it's one of the worst versions of choline, but it still helps with mind-muscle connection and just overall focus. Then they give us 400 milligrams N-acetyl-L-tyrosine. N-acetyl-L-tyrosine is a uh, more, it's supposed to be a form of tyrosine easier to cross blood-brain barrier and just uh, more bioavailable, I believe. Um, I like normal tyrosine more, but uh, still a good dose in here of it. Then they give us 200 milligrams area dorensis. Area dorensis is an overall feel good, uh, nootropic head buzz sort of. Uh, it's a stimulant. Um, it's decently strong, good to have in here. It goes great with caffeine and the theobromine. Uh, really helps with mood elevation and just overall uh, focus and feel good just to add to the full formula of this pre-workout. Uh, finally, we have 3.334 grams of beta alanine. Uh, beta alanine is your endurance ingredient. It gives you the tingles, the itches. Uh, if tingles. Yeah, butthole tingles. <laughs> if you're fully saturated, uh, you'll get more like power output and more endurance overall in the gym. Uh, but you need to be taking it for, I believe it's like three weeks to be fully saturated of three grams a day or so. Um, then finally, last ingredient, 10 milligrams black pepper extract. Uh, Bioparine is the other name of it. Uh, that's uh, for absorption, just get the ingredients into your system better. Um, yeah, so this label, straight up, this is just a uh, high stim label. There's no pump ingredients or anything like that. So uh, let's talk about the experience. Carter, you can start us off with the experience. So I've had one of these before a couple of months ago. Um, it was pretty good. It was the blue raspberry flavor, but we had the, I believe it's watermelon flavor this yeah. time. Um, it's It kicks in right away. You know, it takes like five minutes. Most pre-workouts take about, you know, I would say like 15 to 20 minutes to kick in. But with this one, it kicks in right away. You feel the beta right away. Um, there's a lot of beta in it. Caffeine, you know, it's a lot of caffeine. Feel good energy. Um, you know, you just want to, you know, get going. You know, it uh, doesn't really die down through the workout. It's just a feel good through the whole thing. Yeah. Uh, the, yeah, we have the watermelon flavor. It's pretty disgusting. I'll give it like a one out of five on the flavor. Uh, yes. No, flavor doesn't matter, but yeah. Yeah, it's pretty bad. So if you like no. flavor on pre-workout, I'd not recommend this for the flavor. Uh, yeah, like Carter said, I'd say like 15 minutes I took this, uh, you start to feel, I got, first thing I felt was some, uh, my temperature, my body temperature raised. Uh, then you start to feel a little bit of like uh, anxiety, not an anxiety in a bad way, but just an anxiety that you need to start lifting weights, stuff, uh, kind of feeling like that. Um, yeah, and then you get into your workout. It's a really nice, smooth energy. It's a good, smooth mood elevation. Nothing like close to DMHA for the mood elevation, but it's like, it feels clean. It feels not like you're doing anything bad to your body. It's like, this is uh, just a solid, like, high stim, but no, like, high stim without the exotic stims, if that makes sense. 
Uh, great, yeah, great mood and elevation. Um, the energy is good. Like 500 milligrams caffeine. If you don't have a caffeine tolerance, that's gonna make you feel probably yeah, bad. Do so. not take this your first time. It's, yeah, or take one scoop. It's sure. a stim junkie pre workout. I wouldn't say stim junkie as well, much, but it's, it's yeah, it's, it's more oriented towards the people that have more stim tolerance. But yeah, so if you talk this. One scoop. One you scoop. take one scoop, you lower Maybe, maybe three yeah. quarters, a little bit less, but. Um, great overall pre-workout. Last uh, probably two hours, the energy. It's not like an all day one. Like it does die off. I, I get a little bit of a crash with this one, but no like bad mood or no, nothing like that. It's just a little bit of a tiredness, but nothing terrible. Um, yeah, so you can get a good two hour, two and a half hour workout with this. Uh, yeah, you get some thermogenesis. Like I was sweating my ass off Sweat most of the workout. So yeah, Carter was, I know he brought it up to me. He's like, dude, I'm sweating like crazy at the end of the workout. Um, so yeah, that's ESP's, uh, this is their extreme. I know they have another one. This is supposed to be their high uh, energy one. Um, I'm gonna recommend this one middle ground. Like we said, not necessarily for beginners, but you could be, you, this is like a good one for maybe stim junkies that need a be daily pre, maybe daily. not daily, but like something that's not full of the exotic, not great for you stims, but you want something that'll still hit hard. The ESP is for you. Uh, we can talk about the pumps. There's literally yeah, no pumps. No pumps no at pumps, all. No um, pumps. Don't if I were you, pump. and if you like the pumps, add pump to yeah. it. Like you literally don't even expect a pump from this. This will probably make your pump worse if anything, because the vasoconstriction uh, and there's literally nothing in here to actually give you sort of a, uh, like I think the only thing to actually help your pump would probably be caffeine and the uh, theobromine because they kind of give a little bit of vascularity, but there's no actual pump, nitric oxide precursors, nothing like that, no glycerol. Beta alanine is the only sort of endurance, um, actual beneficial towards your muscle ingredient in here. Uh, so yeah, I give this one to the middle ground area, not to sim junkies, but not to beginners. If you are a beginner, you can definitely try this one out because it's a 50 serving and you start with one scoop. Um, overall, what do you rate this one, Carter? I'll give it a, you know, eight out of 10, um, flavor, you know, no pump. Um, you know, that's about the only bad thing about this free workout. Um, you know, it was good mood. Um, you know, you felt good the whole time. Um, with this one, I don't really crash. Um, I feel decent the whole day, so that's a good thing about it that okay. I like. Uh, and then, um, oh, I was gonna say something. Uh, we got, so, yeah, you can, uh, th this one, uh, yeah, I'm gonna give this one a seven out of 10. Uh, you guys can pick this one up on, uh, I have a couple links down below. You guys can check this one and pick this one up. Uh, it's not too expensive. Uh, average is like 35 bucks, I think, mm -hmm. so. Uh, pretty good pre-workout. Uh, I give it a seven out of 10, Carter gave it an eight. Uh, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure you check out the links below to check out other uh, pre-workouts and you can buy ESP with a discount. All of the links below have a discount. Uh, yeah, we'll see you guys in the next review. We'll probably be doing uh, Helios, uh, their limited edition or something along those, like, those lines. We're gonna die. <laughs> Peace out. See you guys.